Do you see this box? This box came all the way from Japan. I ordered this, I don't know, February, January. I don't know. I actually don't remember. And I, I took the packing slips out. So there was no chance of anything um, happening here. Insane Jedi, thank you so much for your reset. Thank you for 56 months of support, 56. Are we really that high? Guys, are we really that high? Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Insane Jedi. Thank you so much for your continued support. Thank you for helping, definitely to help keep the lights on over here. Uh, thank you for popping in and, you know, being with us, sharing some of your time with us. Very much appreciate it. Saying, hey, Tiff, are we dating Stephen Strange yet? Dude, we are working on it. We are working on it hard. Erg. Yeah, no, it's definitely trying. Um, what's in the box? So, this is a movie I've never seen, but I do want to see it at some point. Um, but I, I know it's going to be very sad, so I haven't had the guts to watch it yet. Um, many of you, I'm sure, have already seen it. It's called Grave of the Fireflies. It's an uh, animated movie from Japan. Um, and in that movie, there is a fairly famous Japanese candy in there. And um, I had read an article that said that the makers of the, the candy um, were going out of business. They've been in business for 114 years, but apparently with um, pandemic and the rising cost of materials they were shutting their doors and um they weren't going to be here anymore and so even though i haven't seen the movie i was like i want the candy i want to have it i'm not going to have i'm not going to consume it until i watch the movie so now i gotta watch the movie now i gotta watch the movie maybe sometime this weekend um but i wanted to have it so i ordered two this box is way bigger than that so i'm gonna guess i ordered something else and i don't remember what I ordered. So if we don't mind, we're going to open this up really quickly and take a look at it. Okay, if I was a movie I watched once and I'm glad I watched it, never watch again. Yeah, that's how I think I'm going to feel about this. Um, e. I think I read on like one of the packing slips, like they gave me a freebie. It's a little eraser. I'll never use that. Why give me a decorative eraser? I'm never going to use it. It's too cute. Um, okay, this is adorable. This is like packed in Japanese. Um, newspapers so as you can hear they're in a metal tin it's a basic i think my if my understanding is a basic fruity sugar candy like hard candy um but they've been making them like this since 1908 here it is here's the character from grave of the fireflies holding it um but like i i have even though i've never seen this movie i am like intimately familiar with this tin i've seen this everywhere i've seen drawings of it i've seen people posting this i have seen this tin and i didn't want to miss out on having this tin um so here it is apparently they're best until october so i have until october to consume them or at least one box i don't know if I'll, i i guess i'll open both of them. i kind of don't want to open both of them um so it's i i it's sad because i know the movie is sad it's sad because to see a company that's been around for that long, like, close. I don't know. It, there's, like, a sadness there. So there we go. I got two of them. Hooray. I didn't want to go crazy. I'm one of those people. I'm like, I'm going to resell them. Because I did see them already being resold places. And I was like, that's not what I want them for. Um, we got some fun Japanese newspaper. So I will take a look at that later on. Ooh. Ooh. What's that? I don't know. Um, and then there's something else in here. And I legitimately don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know what I ordered, but I clearly ordered something else. So let's figure out what other thing I ordered from Japan. Came with these fun bubbles. I desperately want to pop them, but let's not do that. There was a chance to check out the crazy new designs for the new Avengers villains from Mackie. I did not. But I feel like I should. It's Howard Mackie. Oh, damn. This is like really taped up. Uh, Can she rip it? Is there a seam here? Yes. Yes, there is. Okay. Okay. All right. What What did I order? Take your bets before I open it, chat. What do you think I ordered? Because this is the shape of it. It doesn't make any noise. Bees? Always got to shake it up. You never know when the bees are coming out. A mug? I, mug's a really safe bet. A mug is a very safe bet, knowing myself. Knowing myself, this is probably a mug. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. Let's find out. Uh, 
Oh, it's in plastic. Okay. Well, this is, this is, okay. It's still in something. It's a mug. It's definitely a mug. It's a cup of some kind. <gasps> I am good to myself. I ordered myself a Tanuki mug. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Trappy. Thank you so much. I don't, I'm seeing it, I kind of remember this. Wow. Thanks, past me. That's great. Look at that. Look at that. Wow. This is so cute. Well, past me is great. This is, this is awesome. I don't know where I'm going to put this, but I, I love this. Hooray! <laughs> awesome. Yay. I ordered, I, it's not like I didn't pay, it's not like somebody sent this to me. I paid for this. I just don't, I didn't remember ordering this. I remember, distinctly remember the can, like ordering the candy. I definitely remember ordering the candy. I did not recall ordering this mug too. So that's fun. A little surprise for me. I guess I figured if I was already paying the shipping for Japan, I might as well get something else. That's that seems like something I would do. That that seems like me. That 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 tracks. That tracks. Oh man. Oh now I want to use it. I love it. It's so cute. I should put my candies in there. No, my candies have a, a tin. So yay! These came all the way from Japan, directly from Japan. They had to go through customs and all that crap. And I, I was gutsy, guys. I didn't pay for the extra insurance on this stuff. So, like, they were like, this could be lost forever. And I was like, you know what? I'm, I'm going to gamble. I'm going to gamble. I don't know if I'd gamble every time, but I gambled this time. It's like finding money in your pocket, right? That was always my money. <laughs> yeah. I really want to try these, so I'm definitely going to have to watch The Grave of the Fireflies now and be sad. Let's be sad, everybody. All right. All right, let's jump into some Avengers. Or some Avengers. So you guys can be talking about Avengers because you guys are talking about Avengers in the chat. Let's jump into some Midnight Suns. Oh, there's a QR code. Will that work? What will that take me to? Hmm, this smells old. This smells very old. Oh my god, that's a little adorable pig! And he's riding a tractor! We need more mascots like this. Our adorable pig mascots. Oh, who's that guy? I don't know who that guy is, but he looks serious. It looks like a temple. Fun. All right, I'll look at that later. I won't bore you with me looking at that. Let's do this Avengers. Never. Never again. Okay. I don't remember us having a book from book club last time. If we're being completely honest. Sure. Really did not remember that we had a book. Do we have a I didn't read it. Did we have a book? Oh, crap. What was the book? Wow, okay, yeah, Wolverine's here for that punch. No one has drank this punch, though. So, Wolverine, you can have all the punch, baby. It's all yours. AJ Wenzloff, thank you for the follow and for hanging out with us. Appreciate you. Oh, that was the book? Oh. that w I thought we did this book club already. I was wrong. Oops. Oh, sorry, guys. There out. you go. Thanks, Wizard of Wind. And what is it about them? And Drew. Appreciate all of you. And Josh. <laughs> I just didn't turn that one on. I thought I did. Ah, surprise Steve Rogers there for a second. Surprise, Steve. Can we start? I am ready. Uh, I didn't read this book. It's fine. All right, Logan, I need to know. Why did you choose this book? 
I'll tell you, just not yet. I want to hear what you thought of this book. It was written in the 1940s, so I expected some repugnant attitudes and phrases, but it surprised me. The writing was simple, yet the story was deeper than it had any right to be. What was your favorite part? It's in the chapter where Crash and the Princess escape the Zorgots. The next morning, they see the sunrise and Mars rising beside it. When the Princess asks what the future holds and Crash just stares at Mars as it eclipses the sun, it gave me chills. I like that's some powerful symbolism. What do you think? Hey, Jen, how are you? Welcome. Is it just me, or do the stellar bodies represent their time together? Absolutely. The time they have together is fleeting. I think this is where Crash first realizes there's no future for the two of them. Anyway, I think the moment gets lost when the Zorgots deploy their Null Stalkers. I don't get why the robot dog didn't warn them. I thought it could talk. Not until number 19, the minefields of the Reticulates. It's a whole thing. Got it. So, what's the idea with Crash's promise? What about it? When Crash apprehends Glaxogorp, they have a tense conversation in the back of the fly pod. Crash says there's a way the Zorgots can leave the moon with everything they want, but the princess must take the throne. Then Crash vows that no queen of royal blood shall ever rule Deimos. Glaxogorp agrees, but why? Crash breaks the vow in the next chapter. Ah, uh, Chocobo Kid, thank you so very, very much for sharing the love and for going above and beyond to gift a T1 sub to What Is It About Them. It's so kind of you. Thank you for that support. Again, thank you for sharing it into the uh, Comic Pop community there. Very, very sweet of you. I hope you're doing well. Thanks for joining us today. Hello. Hey, Technicality, how are you doing too? Hey, Bird. You did not miss Book Club, everybody. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm gonna go with I thought Crash never lies. Glaxogorp agrees because all Zorgots know Crash never lies. Isn't that the point? Crash cares so deeply for the princess that even a vow can be broken. And how does that tie into the hydro gunfight at the top of the space scraper? Really? You don't see it? <laughs> I do. They're shapeshifters. Who? Crash and Glaxogorp. No. Yep. But then, when do they... The Hydro Gun fight. Crash gets hit in the helmet and goes down. And what happens whenever Crash is unconscious? The helmet changes color. Turns bronze like the suit. Right. Then Glaxogorp pulls up on the rocket sled and takes Crash and the princess into custody. That's when they make the switch. Can Crash I love that reference. Thank you so form. much for stopping by. Thank you very, very much for that support as well and i hope you have a great rest of your day and now we'll all leave and just wonder who you are um yo um is this carol this time standing up who's who's standing right now could you uh <laughs> Check out the back of those knees. So sexy. Ooh, baby. Hmm. And crash spacesuit. I kind of want to answer that just to know how that works. Brian Brawler, wow, thank you so very much for your very kind share saying I forgot how hilariously absurd these character names were. It's like someone plugged absurd names into the Mad Libs story, right? Yeah, I'm with you. I'm going with Spaceship. It is hey, obvious. Ripley. They put her in Crash's suit. Exactly. Crash won't need it to survive because they're within the bubble city. So we get to the Dimos Council meeting. 
the princess refuses the throne and declares her love for Crash, who is the princess in Crash's suit. When they embrace, the false princess deactivates the Magna Manacles binding Crash. But Crash nabs the Star Scepter from the fake princess, activates the suit's zoom vest, and smashes through the monoculus. So, if that's the actual princess, she escapes. But who is the false princess? That's a shape-shifted Glaxogorp. Without the Star Scepter, Deimos can't crown their queen. Right. She never wanted it, and the Zorgots definitely don't want it. Glaxogorp, posing as the princess, can steer Deimos away from war. And when the fake Glaxogorp vows the Star Scepter shall be restored to the princess, that's actually Crash. So Crash made two vows and broke Oh my god, look at these two on this date. The cliffhanger with Glaxogorp chasing yes. Crash's ship is actually Crash returning to the princess so they can escape Deimos. You got it. They reveal the switcheroo at the beginning of number six, Attack of the Intergalactic Space Weasels. Clever. I like it more now. And that's where we'll call it for tonight. So, Logan, why did you pick this book? Because it's fun. No other reason? I ship it, me too. Every book doesn't... I almost wish this book was a comic instead. Hey! Would have liked to see That's the right, Cap. Well, Cap, you're an artist. Why don't you draw it, man? Why don't you, you know, make your own comic out of it? Okay. Okay, hang on. Guys, we have a slight disaster here happening. Excuse me. There we go. Okay. Sorry, Ripley has decided that she has graced me with her presence, which I absolutely adore. However, in doing so, she got completely tangled up in my headphone wire. But we're good now. We're good. She's happy. That's, that's the most important thing. And uh, my wire is safe. Second most important thing. Uh, anyway, okay. Tip thing, thoughts on Steve's characterization in this game. He was the only one of the characters I was pretty... Which Steve? Are you talking about Steve Rogers or Stephen Strange? I'm going to guess you're talking about Steve Rogers. Because you said Steve. Hey, Oscar. Hey, Colton. Welcome. Welcome one and all. My book was the best of them. You have only been to two meetings. Yeah, but you know I'm right. I mean, I you are right. You are right. Logs. You do not mention a book for next time. Yeah, with everything going on, I'm going to put book club on a hiatus. Until things are less Aww. apocalyptic. Oh, good. I can't say good idea. I'm gonna miss this. Let's say that. I hope we come back to this in the future. Same here. Books are a gourmet meal for thought. Not to call anyone out, but you just can't feed your mind gristle. Oh. I kind of want a joke. Book club canceled. I'm sorry. It would be a shame if Nico heard you say that. Nice try. She knows what I think of her taste in movies. Besides, I said it to her face last week. What did she say? Don't make me magic all your books into screenplays. Unpublished screenplays. In the face of a threat like that, I'm not too proud to admit I backed down. <laughs> Actually, I need to thank you for sticking around since the beginning. For all your help with Carol. Oh. I don't get close to many people. I never get into relationships. That's not a rule I ever break. But I did with Carol. Beyond all the reasons, I find her amazing. Do you know why? Uh. Um. She's an Avenger? Badass? Joke? Alright, let's go for the joke. You are into her because she can kick your ass. That's exactly it. <laughs> really? I oh, was joking. Nice. Well done, everybody. I'm not. Vampires fight dirty. They'll kill whoever you love just because they can. If they really want you to suffer, they'll turn your true love into one of them. That's why dating me is a death sentence, and I refuse to put that weight on anyone. 
But can you imagine some pissant vampire trying to chow down on Captain Marvel? First his fangs would snap off on contact with her skin, then she'd just chuck it into space. No hiding from the sun out there. Carol's There's like, no way um, they can I can touch hear her. you. I'm like right over here. It is you. She is safe from you. Yeah. I never break my rule because I know deep down there's a chance I could lose control. But with Carol, hell, she could hold me over her head till I was myself again. Wouldn't even break a sweat. I'm looking for a snack. I have I have this bin of Japanese snacks under my desk. I've decided I want one. I don't know what I want though. I think I want something savory. So I'm gonna pull it from that side of the box. I don't remember what these are. Um, I don't know what to say here, guys. Do you like the joke, or should we should we go for like the tragedy option? What's your opinion, everybody? Okay, let me go with these. Let me go with some rice crackers. <laughs> Step on me, joke. Okay, we're done. I'm down for the joke. Let's joke it up. Completely unrelated. I want to watch Captain Marvel bench press Blade. I would not. You are no fun. And you already knew that. Well, I'm glad you joined me for all of this. Maybe next time the world is ending, I'll start a sparring club. A sparring club? Is that just training with a fancy name? You saw right through me. You calling it? I guess I should yeah. leave. Peace. Um, so the question earlier was how I felt about Captain uh, America's um, characterization in this game. I don't feel like he's utilized enough for us to truly get a handle on his characterization. I think it's a little surface level. Um, and maybe that's what maybe folks who don't care for his version in this game don't like about it. It's just that there's not a lot of depth to it because it's not really about him. He's just there as a supporting character. Um, so there's not a whole lot that they do in terms of getting to know him any deeper than what we know about Captain America in general. Um, so for that reason, I didn't really mind it because in my head, I'm like, Cap's just here just as like a member of the overall like chorus around the Hunter and Midnight Suns characters, so. Hmm. That's right. This is one of those, like, if a target is blocked, you get more damage. And that's so few and far between. I'm gonna go with this one. These are good. These are very good. They're rice crackers, so they're arade. Arade. Arade? I don't know how to really say that appropriately. Supposedly they're mayonnaise flavored. I don't taste it. They just taste delicious. And each each one is a different color and they're differently flavored. These are really good. There's a problem. I could see that. That he comes off a little more as a stereotype. That's what I'm saying. I think it's just What's too surface doing, level. <laughs> well, like I said, the library is all yours again because book club's over. He's close, Hunter. Kathon is slithering his way into this dimension. I can feel it. I mean, you really have nothing to worry about. You're a ghost. You can't die anymore. I oh, know. You know what? You're magic. You could probably definitely die some more. Wanda, there's something I ought to say to you. Oh. Oh, hey, Nico. <laughs> Yay, we did it. Ugh, the first time we're actually trusted to sit in the driver's seat, the first freaking time, and we couldn't stop her. Can't be we that mad, Nico. A mountain on her head, and Lilith still managed to summon the Temple of Cathod. We must put crackers away. Team. Oops. Oops. 
I just crunched a cracker. Those are really yummy. Uh, Brian, thank you for your cheer saying, uh, I do like Cap. Just seeing him be more of uh, or be more of a mentor slash confidant for Hunter is something I've never really seen Cap do. Yeah, yeah, he's just like he's he's almost like a sage like character. Caretaker supposed to be more of that, but Cap definitely rings in as like, you know, I I if the if it gets bad, I will step up and lead. But I don't think I need to do that. I appreciate that. I definitely appreciate that about him. Um, I do not know what- I never know what to say to Nico. I never know what to say to her. <sighs> I kind of like it's not the end of the world yet. Like, I, I, you know. I don't know. Nico's a tough one. Go neutral. All right, let's go neutral. It is not the end of the world, Nico. Yes, it hey. is, but it's literally the end of the world. The Temple of Cathan is here, and soon giant flying squid god will come to feast on all of our souls. Listen, sometimes giant Nico, squid gods show I'm up. I'm not going to let that happen. Chosen one, remember? <laughs> the world really must be ending because both you and Stark are being nice to me? What did he say? What are you oh, talking yes. about? I'm always nice to you. Nothing like an apocalypse to bring people together. No, there's not. All right, I'm gonna stay out here a while and lick my wounds for a little bit longer. Thanks for uh, checking up on me. Anytime. Like, girl, relax. What is it about them? Yeah, exactly. Oh, oh, it's Tony out here with talking to her. Oh. Hers are still a little jittery. Are yours? No? Okay, just me then. That's cool. Okie dokie. Are you having um, problems with your depth perception? Sort of Wanda. Wanda. I see you and Caretaker are on the mend. Seems so. I should be happy about it. But how can I be happy about anything when the Temple of Cathan is wreaking havoc on my home? I grew up in Transia, you know. In a remote village at the foot of Mount Wondercore. Really? It's all destroyed now. Along with those poor people's lives. These seem like all good answers. These seem like all fine. Well, <laughs> Great. Just because I didn't have enough cat fur on my face, now there's even more. Where's your brother, right? Avenge them? I do kind of like avenge them. Is it two on the nose? All right. The casualties I'm going for Amanda. Where did Kitty go? She's, she's over there. She's just in the window. We will there's a bird feeder out there, so there's birds. She's looking at one of them. I really hope we can. Hey, well, it is not we got a matter two, of but we got one dark point. We must. The world depends on it. Literally. Whatever it takes to stop your mom, right? Whatever it takes. I'm afraid of her, you know. Of seeing her. I mean... What if it happens again? What if she turns me back into bad Wanda? What if I go dark? Well, how many points have you been putting into dark points? That's really what we're to start with. What do your point allocations look like? What kind of cards are you getting? <laughs> I kind of like this one. But I also, like, I don't know. I want to know where this is going. Like, I would like to know the rest of this statement. Like, is this going to be like, Lilith chose you for a reason and it's because you're badass, so don't worry about it? Or is it going to be Lilith chose you for a reason, you should definitely worry about it? Do I care enough to risk it? Should I just click it? This is safer. Light option. Uh, 
<laughs> yeah, I'm the one who's got the cracked collar. You're gonna be fine, lady. It's end game anyway, right? I don't think we're that end game. I think we have a couple more missions to go. YOLO, okay, fine. There is a reason my mother wanted. Let's find out. I want to know what this is. Oh yeah, I'm not so sure that's a good thing. Just embrace who you are. That's the last thing most of the people here think I should do. Maybe so. That didn't go any of the ways I thought it was going to go. To gather the courage it will take to face Lilith again, and survive. So, like fight her darkness with mine? Well. I did not quite say that. Yeah, you did. That is Ripley. And that I was appreciate her. it. Thanks. I needed that kind of resolve. Ah, well, I ought to get back to the news. See what I don't new have horrors the dark are befalling my hometown. Do not watch too much of it. The overconsumption of news media is supposed to be bad for your mental health, especially during an apocalypse. There are worse things for your mental health, Hunter. And I'm pretty sure I've experienced them all. I'll take my chances with a little cable news. Night. Okay. Well, hang on. What suits do I have? That's a fine question. I have... Do, 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 do. I have the light one. Look at me! I've never used this one. Hi Ripley, what are you doing up there, baby girl? How many people? And I, I, I don't think. Oh, hang on, I'll wait. I hope Aunt May isn't watching this because she's going to flip. That suddenly appeared in the war-torn Republic. Try to stop it, but decimating a remote village at the base of Mount Wonder. It's okay, you can say it. Doesn't matter who screwed up. What matters is that we're screwed. On every social media outlet with the hashtag #ApocalypseWow. We're in the end game now. Hey, he said it! How many people who are pet owners have like a name for their pets and they do use it, but they most of the time use a bunch of other things, sometimes related to their pet names and sometimes absolutely not related to their pet names. Wolverine's arms clipping into his chest. That's how swole he is. That's how swole Wolverine is. They got, it's gotta go somewhere, you know? Could I? I'd like to get the, uh, okay. No, can I move around this way? No one's lived through catastrophic world-ending events before? Boring! You're expecting to hear a witty one-liner. I get it. But I gotta say, I'm speechless. You can call her Big Chungus. Very that hard nice. To believe. Guilty, yep. I'm serious! You dropped a freaking mountain on the Hulk, and he waltzed away like it was nothing. I mean, if a mountain didn't kill him, what could? My ego? No, no. I couldn't stand carrying the weight of the entire world. Oh, oh, a billion elephants. A duck the size of a house. Or maybe two mountains. Oh, two mountains. I don't know what to say to him. Maybe one out of three? Steve and Tigger, Kitty, Gremlin, Tiny, Baby, Old Man. There you go. Yeah, Ripley is Ripley. She's my baby girl. She's my love bug. She's my mush. We also call her a xenomorph sometimes. Gizmo. <laughs> Third time is the charm. Maybe we could drop the moon on him. Perfect idea, Hunter. Rock hard just thinking about it. Thanks, Deadpool. I said what I said. What else is there to lose at this point? Literally everything. Figuratively, also everything. The exciting thing is that you don't know. And you know how this ends? Ah-ah! Uh -uh. A Deadpool never reveals his secrets. After all that, we can add another L to the pot. An L? It was like he heard me, yeah. You know, a loss, a goose egg, a big fat zero. I gotta say, I don't know how you keep up the cheerleader attitude. Uh, 
I don't know which way to go here, folks. I believe in us. I have to. I don't, you know. I'll just... I guess I don't know how you keep up the cheerleader attitude. Should we go with I don't? Like, I don't do that. First one? I believe in us. Believe? Okay. I have faith we will still win in the end. Where does this so called faith come from? The good feeling. Yeah, I guess if you had like store? the other characters too, they would have conversations here as well. And my friends, like you. Mm, right in the feels. You sound in pain. It's okay. I'm into it. Just take it sleazy, Hunter. The fight's not going anywhere. Oh, hey. Deadpool and I will be friends. All right, are we good? Can I... Can I go to bed now? Ooh, a chest to be opened. Freebie chest! Oh. Um... What's up with that Doctor Strange palette that we just picked up? Oh. I like how bright blue it is. I don't love the gold trim. It's a little... It's... I, I can't... Mm. You know what it is? I, I wish the cloak was all one fabric. I just realized that now that the red in the back, it, it's actually, it's a, it's a very different fabric. I have a lot of Doctor Strange palette colors. Yeah, it's too much trim. I think you're right. I think it's way too much trim. It's, it's strange. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah. Ah. Okay. And then there's this thing. Which we have, I suppose. <laughs> Boo this one! <laughs> you can't stop me! Ha 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 I'll make all the bad puns I want. I can't think of any right now, but when I do, who are you gonna get one? I'm going up for this legendary. Legendary chest. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give oh, I thought that was literally Cerebro for a second. I Man, I guess it is, but it's not. Okay. What'd you get? Oh. It's kind of interesting. Oh, that's right. I unlocked this. Hooray, it's here! Well, that's gonna be us for the rest of the game. I, I don't like the idea of his pants supposed to be like denim, but they're leather. It's like denim colored leather. I, I don't know. I, I don't like this necessarily on him. I do love that like blue, that, that sort of turquoisey cyan-y blue that's great just just you know I oh all right kind of a, a, a very much a reverse of this look I do love this look with the red hey Dr. Longo thank you for the raid welcome 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 Ah, oh, that's... I don't know why I, I, like, weirdly like this, but, you know, we're just gonna stick with this. Because I like it. I wish I could tell him. Oh, I can wear his combat outfit. Nice! He can just walk around like this all day? Oh, should we do it? Yes! Yes! We're making that happen! Two two shot thank you very much for, um, the follow and for hanging out with us. I appreciate that. I'm gonna go here really quickly. I'm gonna open up a chest back here. I have all these arcane keys I'm not using. 
I get all these color palettes I don't have. Change her to what? Oh, great. I got some stuff for myself, too. Um. Oh, good. I got a face sigil. All right. Um. Ooh, ooh. How do we feel about red? Oh, I kind of like that, too. What is up with being this blue right now? I'm in like a blue theme, right? I, I dig it. Ooh, now I'm part of the X Men. Now I'm an X Man. Sting like a bee. Dazzle him. And oh, my, my Midnight Sun's outfit. Oh, I got a different color palette for this, too. All right. Okay. If I wear this, can I tell my... Can I not wear this? No, I can't choose not to wear... Wait, no. Yes, I can. <gasps> Even better. Alright, there we go. Is that better? All right, anyway, I'm gonna put myself back in my regular fit that I've been enjoying. My blue period. Exactly. You know why I think I'm really vibing on... I like the blue, don't get me wrong. But you know why I think I'm really vibing on the yellow is because I have purple hair and purple and yellow are complementary colors. So my brain's like, oh, oh, so good. We're buying that and I'm wearing it. Okay. Change, I can't change Wanda. I've got nothing to change her into. We just, oh, you mean like her outfit like this? Everything sucks. I could just tell her to wear her combat outfit all day. Is that better? Is that like slightly better? I feel like that's better. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's grab one more chest and then let's head into um, the next day. And uh, whatever trash is coming at me. Oh, is it in the cave? Is it in here? No. Where is this chest? Where is this supposed chest that I'm meant to find? I'm like nowhere. I, I hate. I wish there was a mini map. When I'm out on the island, like when I'm out in the rest of the abbey area, I desperately wish there was a mini map. I am 100% going the wrong way. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, like go through the gate, use the roads? Oh, fine. Make me use roads, like they're important. Oops. These things are actually important so I can make those healing cards. I need occasionally. Oh crap, it's up there. Damn it! I'm not up there! Okay. Now I'm up there. We are so fast. Oh, hey. And Wanda got a new palette for her outfit. That's funny that that happened. Um. <gasps> oh! I don't know if I love the head sock look, but okay. Okay, that's, that's closer to what she's meant to look like. All right, let's use some gloss. Why not? It's silly looking, but that's what she's supposed to look like. Hang on, I gotta put this on so I can see. Oh, choices. Choices were made. Okay. And back to the Abbey. And to bed.
Country Club Wanda. Oh, hey, ma'am. You have gone too far, mother. I could say the same to you, child. Leaving me for dead and buried under that mountain. I did do that. What a way to treat your mother. One look at Transia tells me everything I need to know. Sarah was right. My mother died centuries ago. It pains me to hear you say that. <laughs> Especially when everything I have done has... Do not say it. Do not tell me you have unleashed all those horrors in my name. I do not need to. All will be revealed soon. The Darkhold is finally complete. The prophecy draws to its close. The Midnight Sun is coming, and with it, him. We will all have our final parts to play. Will you be ready when the curtain rises? It is not I who seems to be wrestling with their destiny. What are you not telling me, mother? Such an inquisitive and perceptive child. You remind me of him, you know. Oh, my dad? I thought we could not talk about him here. Don't be ridiculous. Not him. Him, your father. The similarities are impossible to ignore. I have never heard you speak of him until now. We close upon the end of a billion years prophecy. Forgive me if I'm a bit sentimental. I sometimes hey, wonder if I bitch. could bring his soul to this place. To have him stand once more beside me. Beside us. I implore you, do not. He would not be thrilled with you, I'm sure. In his death, he has been spared the sight of the foul creature you have become. Damn. I envy him for that. Ouch. What? No snappy comeback? Promises that we shall be reunited under the glorious Shit. eye of the midnight well, like, sun? Alright, enough of you. No, child. Not this time. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I'm trapped in my room. Oh wait, nope. It's still nighttime. Hey, Ags. Agatha. I'm sorry to intrude, dear. Do you have a moment? I mean, I'm locked in my room, for so you? yeah. Of course. And I sleep in my you sweater. You always came jeans. to me for advice when vexed by a difficult problem. Never Sarah. Sure. I could always count on your wisdom. Really? I always feared I was flying by the seat of my broom. Did I tell you I had one of those in the 1960s? <laughs> Quite comfortable. A seated broom? Where is it now? Can I see it? Lost in the chaos of an unforgettable music festival. What? <sighs> it was a wild year. Okay. Shame. So, what troubles you? I don't know how to say this without sounding melodramatic, but despite our actions, the prophecy unfolds. Cathan's return seems inevitable. Yet all I can do for the people I love is haunt a library and play macabre tour guide. Agatha. I should be here with Sarah and yourself, helping well, you to die team I... together. But I never have felt more useless. Well, you're a ghost. Uh, I'm sorry, Hunter. I leave you to your rest. Agatha, wait. <sighs> Good night. Agatha. Hunter, I'm coming in. Oh, don't come in. I'm totally in the nude. <laughs> Where is she? I heard you speaking with her. Uh, uh Um No, no you didn't. Just yeah. You know. 
definitely did not hear me talking to her. <laughs> what do we think, folks? Finally. <laughs> Ooh. I am surprised you can hear Agatha. Then you don't deny it? Why would I? Especially to you. Why didn't you tell me earlier? Why didn't you tell Caretaker? I made a promise not to tell. To who? Oh, oh he almost didn't make that early. <laughs> then why now? Because if you can hear Agatha, the two of you need to have a long talk. <sighs> I don't know if I could face her. Then let me talk to her. <sighs> All right. I'm trusting you, Hunter. Good night. Oh, go back to sleep. Thanks. I'd like to, I'd like to get in my bed now. Oh, I'd like to have um, you know, insomnia or whatever. It's the Ripley! Oh, that's right, I put it on random. I never know what I'm gonna be wearing when I wake up. <gasps> Steven. Sure, that's me. Why are you smiling? Because you're dead. Hangman. Damn it. No offense, Hunter, but you suck. I couldn't have come up with an easier answer. <laughs> the wow, irony I suck. of a Dampier telling me that I suck is not lost on me, Eric. Hey, keep it down or this game isn't the only thing you'll be losing tonight. Is that why you brought me here? To tell me how much I suck at parlor games? Actually, I'm here to tell you how much you don't suck. You're turning out to be one of my favorite people. And I don't like people. Alright, what do you like, chat? <laughs> Kill? What about Carol? <laughs> He's like, ew, I don't like you like that. Don't be gross. Don't be gross, Hunter. My heart belongs to Carol. It said the feeling is mutual. It's mutant. Ah, it's a mutant feeling. It's, you know, it's different, strange. One, two, or four. Words four. All right, let's try. What about Carol? What about Captain Danvers? Is she not your favorite person? I don't know her as well as you. Been a while since I've had someone to lean on who handles their inner demons with as much swagger as you do. You remind me of this guy I used to work with, Hannibal King. He knew how to walk the line between good and evil without falling off. Not unlike you. Sounds like a kindred spirit. One, two, one. Okay, let's go one. Sounds like another kindred spirit. He was. Man, was he one lousy vampire. But I guess you have to be a lousy vampire to be a good vampire detective. Vampire detective? That is a first. We worked together to track down the vamp who killed my mother, Deacon Frost. He didn't have to help me, but he did. Proves that even the baddest of the bad can still have a heart, even if it's not beating. Resisting succumbing to your own darkness takes a shitload of willpower. I'm proud of you for resisting yours. Just don't fall off the wagon. What happens if I do? 
Then I'll just have to kill you. Just like I killed my mentor, Jamal. You never told me what happened with that. Well, here's the abridged version. Dracula turned Jamal into a Class A Nosferatu, and I had no choice but to put him down. Hardest thing I ever had to do. But mark my words, Hunter. If you ever go 100% evil on me, I won't think twice about taking you out, too. Yeah, well, he's the only one that actually was on the Midnight Suns out of the group that they have there, so he, he should have a big role here. I like, I'd do the same for you. You taking this? Are you gonna take my hairband? Is that what you're gonna do? I would do the same for you, you know. What do you mean? If you ever became a danger to others, I would stake you in a heartbeat. Well, let's hope it never comes down to that. Already lost enough friends that way. Don't want to lose another. Then here's to not killing each other. I'll drink to that. Oh, and Hunter, this blood's for you. Yay! Rare passive attacks and heroics have a 25% to chance, chance to apply one bleed. Nice. And we got a rare palette for him. Because <laughs> we're so fancy. We're so fancy. I do want to see what the palette is, even if I can't wear it. Oh. Mm, no. But, okay. Hello, Miss Ripley. What would you like? What would you like, my love? The little love bug demands things of me. Would I not have a passive for him before this? No. Oh. Nice. All right. Friendships. I All right, we need a Wolverine. Hey, can I ask a favor? You're, so you're a pet hellspawn. There's no chance you could snap, right? Wake up and go all demon dog on us? Uh, yeah, no, we're gonna go with the Thanks, light balance Hunter. one. I am to think about that. That's the other. I didn't like the Remember other. Remember that at time all. we fought together in Madripoor? Well, listen to this. Was that the time we fought the twenty-foot-tall robot? You're gonna have to be more specific. I fought a lot of twenty-foot-tall <laughs> robots. Sentinel. Not sure I can. I've seen too much strange action. It all bleeds together after a while. Makes you wonder how much road we have left to travel. Can't tell if I want it to be a long road or a short one these days. Kind of like these two hanging out together. MJ, can you please drive by May's house and make sure she's okay? If she turned on the news, she's probably scared. I know you're upset, dear. Everyone's in the same boat. She won't want you to be making a fuss, so come up with an excuse as to why you're there. Maybe bring her some cookies. She loves oatmeal raisin. Oh, and she what? probably Why does Mary Jane look like a pile paper? of text? So can you collect the Daily Bugles and bring them in? Maybe check to see if they're running any Spider-Man headlines and ditch those. I can't say when I'm coming back. Hopefully soon. Yes, I'm in a safe place with good people. You can tell that to May too. MJ, I'm going to be fine. Promise. Are you hearing this? It's adorable. Aww. Cute. Hey. I apologize for not having the bandwidth to speak last night. It's just, I'm still in a bit of shock. My mind has been spinning trying to process it all. We don't talk about Paul here. Take I'm gonna all get light points back. Need. That's just the thing, Hunter. We don't have time. There's no excuse. I must pull myself together. At any moment, my sister will unleash Cathan upon the planet. Yet Wanda is back in the library reading as if we were back to normal before... Agatha passed. Half of me wishes she was here so I could ask her for guidance. Oh, yeah, about that. Um, mess. <clears throat> uh. And the other half? is glad she's not alive to endure the horrors of what a Cathan rain would bring. Still, I wonder what she would say if she was here. I 
I like that one. I know one thing she would have wanted. What's that? To see this rift between you and Wanda finally healed. Ah, I know. But I'm not quite ready for that. Not yet. Just do not wait until the world is over to do it. It may never happen then. Not in this life. Ah, I need to get my head together. Now that the Temple of Kathan is revealed, our options are dwindling. We're gonna explode! I think we all know that. Oh, it's a Captain America. Alright, so we have to do... We have to do one. We have to do a regular one. Um... Ugh, Nest Mothers! Alright, so we can do one with magic. I don't want to do a hard one. I don't feel like doing that. We can do one with Spidey. We can do one with Blade. Or we could do one with Deadpool. Pick whose mission we're going to follow. And we'll do that. Meanwhile, I'm going to get my uh, Gamma Coil checked out while you guys are discussing. And then we'll grab our team and we'll jump into at least one mission today. Hey, Doc. I, was thinking, I love Nest Mothers. They're great. Who doesn't love a good Nest Mother? They're all amazing and awesome and, and perfect. <laughs> Sometimes, I even impress myself. Ooh, a new one for Nico. Target an enemy, damage them, or random nearby enemies four times. Ooh. Consume all bleed on a target to deal remaining bleed damage. Oh, that's kind of fun. All right, let's take these two. I feel like I could automate this process and take... What have you brought me today? I don't know, Steven. Let's find out together. Hold my hand. The cup of laughing whispers. Oh, this is magic. <laughs> See, that's what it's doing, because it's whispering. Does that do anything for me? Ready when... Really? Alright. Uh, Don't forget to write. Oh. Alright, Deadpool. I've got two super links here. I didn't even notice this. All right. Oh, I found one of my favorite records, and I thought you might like it, or at least be polite enough to fake it. Well, are we hanging out anyway, in my room? We'll Check out my super dope, amazing room, time. Nico. It's a little retro, but <laughs> so are you. So, what do you think? Uh, I guess lively, I like it. Wait, maybe we're in Nico's room. Maybe I'm incorrect about whose room we're in. Maybe I don't know whose room we're in. Lively. Frustrating. Sorry, I punched the mic. Well, petting Ripley. But liberating. Reminds me of how I feel toward caretakers sometimes. I like it. Oh, I knew you'd get it. Yeah, we get it's it. It's grunge. It's what happens when you mix the nonconformity of 80s Seattle and tons of punk and rock influence. You get awesome bands like Nirvana, Pearl Jam, Soundgarden, making something super authentic with this messy, dirty sound. It, it puts Seattle on the music map. I used to listen to it repeatedly during my I can't believe my mom stabbed me phase. As you can tell, she was a great mom. Didn't leave me scarred at all. Uh, is that a freaking Morbius cover back there? With the Midnight Suns logo on it? What What is happening? What room am I in? What, what? I know how it's it with that one. It sounds all too similar to my own experience with my mother. 
Except that I had a head start on coming to terms with her evil nature. I cannot imagine being caught off guard. Yeah. I yeah this room got morbid. Upside down. I, I thought I was a normalish kid from a normal family. Sure, they had their middle-aged boomer issues, but I thought they loved me. But they didn't. What is done is done. But I see you are still carrying it with you. Do not be afraid to go wherever you need to in order to find peace. Roger that, Hunter. Okay. No more of this downer talk. Time to listen and let the sounds of angst carry you away. All right, hooray! Nico got a um, passive as well. All right, now let's go talk what to Deadpool. Whoa, don't go this stream just been me talking to people. Is insane. I'm just spreading my seed, hoping to leave my mark in the Abbey, starting here. Why are you gardening? Well, your friends have been avoiding me like the plague, so I decided to make nice with Mother Nature. Speaking of. You seem to be getting really friendly with everyone. That's cute. Why would I not be? They are part of our team. Friendship makes us stronger. Ah, ah, ah. Your team. Don't lump me up with the rest of them. I have a reputation to keep. What is wrong with making friends? Friends Why do I sound are like just I'm in another cave? liability in the world of Mercs. It's like Murder 101, Hunter. Get with the program. Yeah, well, like it or not, everyone's fallen over themselves to be part of your posse. You sound bitter. Do I? Hold on. Let me tone it down for you, Cupcake. I'm just speaking facts here. Don't get me wrong, having a fan club is great. Gets a little weird when they write self-insert fiction, but it's still flattering all the same. Keep up the good work. It strokes my ego. Are you? <laughs> Why do you keep calling them my fans? They are my friends. What makes you so sure? Hmm. What do you guys like? Between one and two. Hey, Cora, how are ya? Talking to him telepathically, right? Just like, I don't want to be in your presence. I'll just talk to you with my mind. Respect each other. One. Oh. Two, one. Oh my gosh. Let's see, I've got two for. I okay, got three for respect each other. Okay, I think we're going with respect. We hold each other with high regard. That is a good sign. Doesn't ring a bell. All I am saying is that I value them. Hmm. Nope, that doesn't sound familiar either. Guess some things are just out of my wheelhouse. I'm gonna say it until the day I die and regenerate. The only person you need is yourself, Hunter. All that personal mumbo-jumbo just weighs you down. Hmm. Alright, this is good. I think most everybody has... Does everybody have a passive now? Yep, I... I okay, yep. 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 Okay, Wanda doesn't have a passive. Spidey does. Wolverine does. I have two, because I'm special. And, and, okay. What is his all day? 24 block, okay, very nice. All right, Deadpool. What does your palette look like that we got for you? Oh, all right. You're you're very green. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now, uh, 
Now Wolverine and he are both on X Force. Yeah, thank you so much for redeeming some points for a stretch. It's a lot of green. It's like a lot of green. Mm. I'll happily take a nice, nice stretch. Stretching's good for you. At least that's what I assume. I'm not a doctor. Cool. All right. Steel wind is always just all gray. Would you like to be gray? We got this for you then. <laughs> I am glad I don't have this. This is silly. That's super. That's freaking baller and I am not gonna buy that but I mean that's just you're not the same character then you're not Robbie at that point I like Robbie but I I, I want this I want this to be the character I'm playing that's fine it's okay it's all good let's grab this, the rising this. Rings of oh, it's just me. <laughs> it is just me there's no oh it's just me Steven, you're very excited to see me. I love you. <gasps> I wonder if the dark suit would be over here, just on the other side of everything. Look at all these suits I'm missing! Boo! Boo me! Danny can't catch it right. That is so true. Danny really, uh... What do we got? War room upgrade? Ah. Sure, now not? we're getting somewhere. Did you say Danny can't catch up or can't catch a break? Is that really where we're going with this now? Is that is that what we're doing? Is this where we are as friends? Okay. Okay. It's fine. Let's put you in timeout. Let's put Danielle Back in timeout. Again. Don't stress it too much. There's no wrong answers here. Uh, Fire I will. burns brighter. How many of these do I own? I own three hell rides. Just what I needed. Okay. All right. Uh, fine. See you around. So you can make that you're playing the long con. Oh, I see. Okay. Ready to work? Play an ability mod. I have a lot of oh, attack essence. What will it do? Let's find out. I don't remember what it's going to do. Ooh, oh, oh, I can choose. Sometimes you just need to vulnerable. spice things up. Try something different. New and improved. Can I add anything to penance? It's like one of my favorite. No, okay, I can't. <laughs> They're like, you can't use that on that. You silly. Okay. Um, I don't know whose mission we're going to do. Who are we taking with us?
Okay, toss out two names. The first two names I see in chat, that's who we'll take into a random battle with us. Nico? Alright, Nico's going. Ripley. Ripley's no, also going. Magic, Done. Right? Wait. Nico. Alright, we're get we got Nico. We definitely got Nico. Who's my other one? Nico and Nico. I can't do double Nikos. I need to. I need someone else. Bub. All right. So Wolverine and Nico are going. Hicks. Perfect. Guess we could help each other out. Ooh, now I see what all. Okay. Perfect. Done. Let's go. Nico has a new ability, and I would like to put that on in her deck. And by a new ability, I mean a new card in her deck. Um... Oops. Oh my gosh, me! Stop! Sometimes I wish there wasn't so much um, talking in this game because I feel like we didn't get a chance to really do much at all. Alright. Hey, fellow nerd. Read anything good lately? You're a nerd. I'm calling credits. Who doesn't want credits? I feel like we haven't used Deadpool in a while. Spend six heroism. I feel feel like we should be able to do that. Let's find out. It is an easy one, though, so let's see what happens. Okay, so we're bringing... I promise we bring Nico, and we're bringing the Wolverine. Um, you know what? We're just gonna take whatever. I'm not gonna even worry about what we're bringing with us. Mistakes will be made. Oh, look at us. Look at how kind of themed we are. Theming. More nest mothers. To hell with those who call for less. All right. Just target the truck with attacks to disable before time runs out. Hydra forces in this area are causing trouble. Let's take them down. Let's knock it Iron out. Metal. Deploy the truck. Okay. Still one of these. All right. Take down anyone standing in your way. We have four truck. turns. You don't have anything flashy. All right, I got a quick here. When one and fuego. Ha ha ha. I choose. Let that be a lesson to you, evil doer. Okay, 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 okay. Um I got lucky with a uh, swarm that time around. Whatever gets the job done. Ooh, and I'll recover 55 health. I'm not gonna worry about recovering a uh, 55 health right now, necessarily. Don't really feel like I need to worry about that. I hate you. I hate you so much, I don't even want to deal with you. Bad luck for 
Ta-da! They're just sleepy. Okay. By one vulnerable and roulette. Let's do it to you. This usually works. A feeble effort. Crude, but effective. Yeah, it is effective, thank you. Thank you for noticing, Wolverine. Alright, Wolverine, I feel like you, you didn't get a chance to do anything here this time around, Fran. Perfect, perfect, good, good stuff. Oh, I can just take her down? Yes! Yes, none of your crap. That's three I've spent. Ow. It's fine. Ow. That's also fine. Everything's fine. Fantastic. And... Sure, whatever. It's your prerogative. We're targeting? Deadpool, okay. Yeah, I'm working on that, but I need to... leveled up but he didn't he didn't like yell about it okay fine and fuego times two oh double and fuego <laughs> right, I need I need a more of a there it is that's what I need. Let me help. I'll take what I can get. Ah. Damage them or random nearby enemies four times. Okay. This is Let's it give for this you. a try. See if I, that counts for my six heroism. Ooh! Oh, this is a great effect. Of these hydra thugs. Oh, I was hoping we would just be good and be done, but I guess not. I suppose we are not good and done. More reinforcements? Oh, reinforcements continue to come. All right, great. Fantastic. But you guys so freaking much. Come on over here, then. <laughs> Very brave of you. Hmm.
Hmm. Okay, let's try it again. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. Let's try this. Strange no doubt. Holy crap, Nico! What? What? Yes. We're amazing. We've done it. Excellent work. Ten out of ten. Good battle. Good battle. Yo. It's kind of fun. Something kind of fun there, especially with him forcing us not to be able to see Wolverine all that well. It's kind of funny. Oh, you know what I think I want to do? Okay. Okay, I think I know what I'm going to do. Okay. 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 Hang on. Hang on. Oops. <laughs> Wrong thing. There we go. Oops. Took a picture of that. Wasn't ready. I want to make this like it's a Wolverine book. But that um but that Deadpool's just taking over what it is. Yeah, I like that. Okay, folks, and with that, we're going to bring our stream to a close. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me. Sorry, Sal and the guys just showed up from after filming. Um, so we're going to end now. Uh, thank you very, very much for spending your uh, evening with me. I appreciate you all taking some time out of your busy days to, to do that. Very much appreciate it. Um, thank you, of course, to our subscribers. You guys helped to keep us running over here. Um, thank you for, uh, to those who've got above and beyond. And uh, gifted a sub or gifted subs. You're very, very kind of you. Thank you very, very much. Um, thank you to those who gifted bits as well. Those help out too. Um, very much appreciate that. Um, it's very kind of you to do that as well. And uh, yeah, I think that's all I got. Oh, don't forget to check out back issues if you haven't had the chance already. And otherwise, make good choices out there, everybody. Stay safe, and I will see you next time. Bye, everybody. Hang on, I gotta find my.